Hey guys, SNX here, welcome back for a new video. As you guys can tell, we're gonna be doing a topic this time. I know I haven't done one of these in a while, actually probably in like the past five, six videos. And also, I'm using a new microphone. I don't know if you guys will hear a difference in the quality. Probably not, because I will keep editing my audio the same way as I did before. Except that this one, it's that one. And it's much smaller, and when I'm gonna be bringing it back to Manchester, it's gonna be ten times easier. So today, as you guys can tell from the title, I'm gonna talk about respect. Now, you guys are probably gonna be like, Ugh, no, another life lesson, make it stop. But no, I'm gonna be t talking more specifically about respect on the internet. So, I'm not gonna say any names because it wouldn't be cool to call out people, but the other day, I was approached by this random dude on Twitter. Uh, not on Twitter, sorry, on Discord. And I thought I knew this person, because, you know, at one point, all the, like, nicknames and stuff start to all resemble each other. So I thought I knew this guy, so I was like, hey, whatever. And I was like, hey, like, what's up, man? And he was like, can I ask you a favor? And I thought I knew the guy, so I was like, uh, what do you, what do you need me to do? I didn't say yes, I just asked him what he wanted. And he was like, yeah, make me an avatar, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, hang on. I wouldn't have any friends who would ask me, like, so bluntly without even, like, so much as a please or anything. So I was like, do we know each other? And he's like, uh, no. And I'm like, okay, so you basically just found me randomly on Discord and decided to ask me to make you an avatar. And I was like, dude, do you realize how disrespectful that is and everything? And he was like, yeah, like, I don't see what's the problem. And I'm like, okay, like, imagine you're on the streets. Maybe you guys will see the problem. So, but imagine you're on the streets and just this random guy walks up to you. No, hi, no, like, how are you? Whatever. Doesn't even introduce himself. Just like, hey, give me money or like do something for me. And I'm, I was, I was so shocked by a behavior like that. And the guy just like, didn't understand why I was like, no, like that's so disrespectful. He didn't even introduce himself to me or like nothing in return. Just expects me to do it for free. How can you feel so entitled? Like the internet is the same as the real life. Like, come on, dude. You wouldn't act like that in real life, which you hopefully not. Oh, fuck. But yeah, I was really shocked by that kind of behavior. And that's the kind of stuff I see all the time on the internet. You can't see the person, so there's no consequence to what you say. But bro, for real, seriously, think about what you say before you say it. Show a little respect to people. It's like all these spam comments. I promised myself I, I wouldn't talk about spam comments because everybody does, you know. And we, there's nothing we can do about it except change the mentality. But, you know, some people are going to keep on being idiots. Can't do anything about that. But we can ourselves stop being idiots. So, you know, let's all together for 2017 stop being idiots together. Yes. But yeah, it's the exact same thing. It's so disrespectful that you would just go around asking people for stuff because you feel so entitled. It's like these channels are like, oh, my con is as good as this other YouTuber, but like this YouTuber gets many more views. I'm going to go and spam his channel for views or whatever. It's so fucking dumb. Guys, just respect other people. They're human beings as well. You can't just take people and use them and then throw them away. People are not toilet paper. You don't use them and then flush them down the toilet. But please stop doing that. It's so annoying. I know this video sounds like me just ranting about fuck a random topic, but I swear it's okay. It's exactly that, but not only. Also have a message. Please be respectful of each other. Don't go ask for stuff. Be entitled. When I said no to the guy, a couple of times it was like, oh, please like let me try again. I'm like, no, now I know the only reason you want to talk to me is because you want me to do something for you. But that's not how things work. If you want to treat me like an employee, then that means you got to pay me. And even then it's up to me to accept or refuse requests because I'm not a prostitute. Hopefully you guys knew that before. But yeah, you can't just treat people that way without even paying them. Even if you're the boss of someone and you treat them with such lack of respect, people are going to leave your company. And basically like I was like, please give me another chance. I'm like, no, obviously not. And then he's like, well, you know what? Fuck you then. And I'm like, sure, whatever. Dude, you're the one asking me to do something for you. And then you tell me to go fuck myself. I was so surprised. I was like, this is so childish, so immature. And I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one who get asked this kind of crap. I'm not even a designer. So I can only imagine what designers have to go through when they're faced with people like this. All kind of work should be recognized, valued, either through monetary elements like money or through, I don't know, social recognition as in like a shout out or something like that, that is worth something. Not just like, oh, please, no, well, fuck you then. What the hell is that? We can act like human beings, respectful of each other. I'm probably going to be doing terrible in this game, by the way, because I'm really not paying attention to what I'm doing in the game. Now, how awesome was that? Like, we won. I mean, isn't that one of the most important things, right? Is winning. Okay, just kidding. No, it's participating. But anyways, guys, 
Please take as a message from this whole video, respect each other, don't use people like toilet paper, and if you really want to, be a little bit more subtle about it. Don't be like, hey, do this for me please, without even introducing yourself or even showing the slightest bit of interest towards someone. Just put yourself in the other person's shoes. Like, why would you say yes to this random person just coming up to you and asking you for stuff? Like, bro, time is money. Okay, no, but you got better stuff to do with your time. So, anyways, that's it for this video. Also, Merry Christmas to everyone. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys asked for Christmas, what you guys got for Christmas, and subscribe to see more. And I'll see you all in the next video.